dear doctor. I have admired you for years. I wanted to tell you I'm delighted that you've taken an interest in me. I don't believe you're telling who I am. Besides, the important thing is what I am becoming. I have some things I'd love to show you. Until then, I remain your most avid fan. Two families killed a month apart in their homes. These attacks were highly organized. The victims carefully chosen. This one is going to go on and on. That's the same atrocious aftershave you wore in court. I need your advice, Dr. Lecter. If you recall well, our last collaboration ended rather messily. How is young Josh and the lovely Molly? They're always in my thoughts, you know. So it's true the Lecter is actually helping with your investigation. We may have a little over three weeks before this freak does it again. I might not have time. I do. I have oodles. You want to know how he's choosing them, don't you? This is a very shy boy, Well, I know what it's like to have people always thinking that you're different. He is refining his methods. He is evolving. What am I doing here? No one will ever be safe around you, Will. A note hidden in Lecter's cell. The killer wants Lecter to answer him through the personal columns. Lecter gave him your home address. Hi. I'm a friend of your father's. Open your eyes. No. I am the dragon. Give me what I need. Before me, you tremble. I'll call you if I think of anything else. Would you perhaps like to leave me a home number? <laughs>